Ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Once again, I'm Nev from Nev's Tech Bits, otherwise known as your Graham's Friendly Neighborhood Basement Dwelling IT Backup. Don't worry, ma'am. I am from the internet, and today I want to show you how you can fix a computer that just won't turn on for whatever reason. All right, so here we have the computer on the test bench, and we just can't get any power from it. We're pressing that button. Nothing's coming on. No lights, no anything. Nothing that's plugged in is even turning on. Sometimes, even if you can't get the power on, every now and then you'll be able to get the, uh, the mouse light on, but that's not even on. So first thing that we need to do to figure out why this is thing isn't working is uh, just pull the plug here at the back of any system you should see directly plugged into the power supply is your universal plug unplug that leave it for about a minute actually sometimes three minutes tops and then give her one more try okay so if that step doesn't work go ahead and plug that sucker back in make sure it's plugged in and come on over some of the dumb things you might have plugged in oh my goodness what is this i have plugged in i got a freaking led light oh, two led lights what's going on here maybe i shouldn't have been using this stuff i got a usb over here i've actually had problem booting uh windows because of a bad wireless usb so make sure just everything absolutely everything is unplugged mouse and keyboard all of it just make sure that absolutely everything is unplugged and try again now those are the first two and easiest steps next step things are going to get more difficult because odds are there's something there's a piece of hardware on the inside of this bad girl that's giving us a hard time and we need to troubleshoot we need to figure out exactly what that is now, taking the top off one of these sweet ladies and having a look inside isn't something I'd recommend for anyone who's really squeamish or doesn't know exactly what they're doing. But if you know what you're doing, then get in here, test the RAM, take out the uh, video card, take out any card, just take it out, put it back in. But when you're putting them back in, kind of, kind of put them back and forth. Sometimes that wears down corrosion. You gotta do it like this, up and down, ladies. Rent corrosion. Sometimes you get corrosion. Sometimes you get corrosion on the pin, so moving it up and down kind of lightly sands off that corrosion. Do the same thing for the RAM. Now, every computer is a different experience to get into, but make sure you do that with the RAM. Take it out, reseat it. And then you see that battery right there about the size of a quarter? If all else fails, take that battery out leave it out for about uh, 30 seconds, plug it back in, and then give her a test. Now, if all of those things don't work, then uh, you need uh, some real professional help, folks. And you're gonna wanna take that into a computer store, but hopefully your thing's under warranty. And if it's under warranty, you shouldn't even need this video at all. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that's it from me now from Nasdaq, but I gotta get this beast back together. Hopefully this has worked out for you. If it has, like and leave a comment. It's always appreciated. As always, folks, take care of each other. Have a good one.